God used and is using this mountain to impact the people who come here. I absolutely love coming here to this specific place for missions because we get to serve the Costa Rican pastors and their leaders. We, we are figuratively the hands and feet of Jesus as we get to tangibly love on them, to prepare their rooms, to cook meals for them. It's amazing to do something tangible, to love them like that, and they see God's love through us. There's real merit in the long-term commitment, not only because you get to know the people involved, as a church, there's a broader understanding of the context of, uh, in which we're serving and ownership of the ministry. We have the opportunity over an extended period of time of, of using this ministry in some much more strategic ways to develop a spirit of missions and of a mission-mindedness within our own uh, congregation. Uh, by the fact that we come here, we know this trip well. And so for people who are just getting involved or thinking that they may um, to maybe getting called to be more involved in either short-term or long-term missions, we can use this trip to help cultivate that and to bring people along. Being in this regular relationship with the Costa Rican church through our partnership with Refugio Solte and IVAC has really kept me on my toes in the sense of that God's church is a universal church and it's a multicultural church. It's not just my church in the United States or my small group of ladies that meet together, but um, because we've been coming so frequently, we have relationships with these women and men, and I'm, I'm reminded to pray for them.